Hi everyone, welcome back. So today we'll be doing, uh, we'll be using StatCrunch to find the mean, median, and mode of a data set. All right, so here's my data. What I'll do is I'll copy it over to my open StatCrunch window here. So what I'll do is I'll go into stat, summary stats, columns. Okay, I'll select the column with my data in it. And everything in here is already pre-selected. All, all except for mode. Okay, so if you want to select the mode also, you have to scroll down all the way to the bottom and add it to your list. So if you're adding it, make sure you hold down control and then you click. Otherwise, you'll end up just selecting whatever you clicked without, if you don't hold down control first. Okay, then I'll go ahead and click on Compute. Okay, so here's the mean. Here is the median. And the mode will be all the way to the right. Okay, now, if you see this under mode, that means one of two things. Either one, there is no mode, or two, you have more than one mode. Okay, so there's really no way to to get stackers to tell you if there is no mode or if there um, is more than one mode. What you'll have to do is you'll just have to sort the data and just kind of eyeball it. Okay, so once you have the uh, mean and median, go ahead and just close this. And we'll have to sort this. So that will be under data, sort. So pick the column with the data that we have. Um, the order that it, that it gets put in doesn't really matter. Default is on ascending. So we can leave that as is. And just click on compute. All right, I'll move this out of the way. There's my sorted data. So I'll just have to kind of look. So it looks like that's one, shows up three times. That's another, shows up three times. And that's another, that shows up three times as well. And that looks like that's it. All right, well, that's it for mean, median, and mode. That's pretty much the easiest thing you can use StackCrunch for. Um, and that's it. So. Thanks for watching this video. Stay tuned for more SackCrunch videos.